Hello, this is Matt with BitcoinID.com. In this video, I'm going to step you through the process of signing up for a Class 1 digital certificate. We are going to be using uh, Firefox for our example here. We're using version 3.6.18. It's very important that you use a browser that has the capability of accepting an SMIME certificate such as Firefox. And also, you must use the same browser throughout this process. So we will be using Firefox today and we're going to start out on the BitcoinID.com homepage. I'm now going to go to the sign up page and we're going to sign up for a level one security Bitcoin ID. So we're going to click the steps here. It informs us that there are several options available to us for getting a class one certificate. Komodo offers a free class one certificate and we'll use that for this example. So I'll click there and that will open in a new tab in my web browser. And on this page I will simply click the free download button. I will now fill out the form. Now a few words about this uh, revocation password. One of the important aspects of SMIME certificates is that they can be reported lost or stolen or for any other reason made inactive and you do that by telling Komodo in this case that your certificate is no longer under your control and you do that by the means of supplying this revocation password. So uh, I suggest that you make it a strong password and uh, one of the ways that you can do that is by utilizing a password generator. The one that I'll be posting a link for along with this video is uh, grc.com slash passwords.htm. Every time you visit this site, a uh, different password will be generated. In this case, I'm using one of the uh, 63 random printable ASCII characters uh, for my password that I generated earlier. So going back to this, uh, you'll enter that password twice. I'm going to opt out of their emailing and I'll click accept here and then click next. All right, so it tells me here that I should be expecting an email to my uh, Gmail account. I'm associating with this security ID. And so we'll then switch over to my Gmail account. And we'll wait a few moments for that mail to arrive. And there it is. So I will open that message. Go ahead and tell it to display the images. And it tells me here that I can click and install the Komodo email certificate, so I will do that. And I get a little pop-up box saying that your personal certificate has been installed. So I will simply click there. Alright, so that is the end of the process. So what has happened here is that behind the scenes, a certificate has now been installed in, uh, into Firefox in this case. And we can look at that certificate by going to Tools and then Options, going to the Advanced option at the top here, going to the Encryption tab, and then going to View Certificates. That will then open up this window here, and we won't want to be on the tab that says Your Certificates. Now it may be for whatever reason that you have other certificates installed, but in this case I've only got the one. So if we want to look at this certificate, uh, we can double click on it here and it tells us that it is an email signer certificate and if I go to the details tab go to the uh, last option here then scroll on down to the subject it tells me what the subject of this particular certificate is and the subject being the person that they're trying to identify. In this case, the only information in their certificate is the email address, bitcoinid.demo at gmail.com. 
So in other videos, we'll show you how to then uh, utilize that certificate using your Gmail account and also how to back up your certificate so that you do not lose it.